True with Guns America, this is the Strasser RS700. Prepare to have your minds blown. This has features not found on basically any other firearm in the world. We're going to see if we can shoot 10 rounds in under 10 seconds. So Strasser makes eight to twelve thousand dollar straight pull rifles in Austria. They have an aluminum action, these really pretty wood stocks, crazy engravings, and they hold insanely tight tolerances. Well, this is a new model that is pretty unique because it is designed around the Remington 700 footprint, which the Remington 700 action is the most prolific and popular action that in a bold action that's ever been made. So this is a basically a Remington 700, but in a straight pull. It means you don't have a bolt that turns down. It just goes back and forth. It is insanely fast. So let's talk about the features of this rifle that I'm going to talk more about this straight pull and what kind of pressures it can withstand. So first of all, this is called the, the RS700 Strasser. It's in a hand laid carbon fiber stock. It's uh, pillar bedded with aluminum pillars. It's got a detachable uh, MDT AICS footprint style magazine. It holds three rounds. This rifle I'm holding in my hands is in 308 Winchester, but it's also available in 6.5 Creedmoor. Those come in a 22 inch barrel. The Magnum version is available in 6.5 PRC right now, and that's a 24 inch barrel. The barrel is Cold Hammer Forge, a Lothar Walther barrel. Uh, it is threaded. This is my only actual true criticism of this entire platform, and that is that this is not a standard thread. It's a 14 or an M 14M by one. It comes with a 5H24 adapter, so it's not the end of the world, but it's just annoying. It's a European thing and it's annoying. So nitrided. Cold Hammer Forge Barrel has a barrel nut, so you can change the barrel yourself, much like a uh, Savage. The action itself is steel. It's a Remington 700 footprint, like I mentioned already, so it fits in Remington 700 footprint stocks. It also uses triggers that work in Remington 700, so it comes with a Timney uh, Elite uh, in here. It's adjustable from two to four pounds. Uh, we already checked this out, so and you guys all are familiar with Timney. Trigger Techs will work on this uh, for this Remington 700. Comes with uh, the Picatinny rail with a QD sling swivel in it on the stock. Comes with a scope base up here. And we actually today mounted a the new Trigicon 1 to 10 for this test that we're going to be shooting. So let's, oh, and, and it's an aluminum trigger guard here like this is a really premium nice rifle so the exact same straight pull technology that is in the twelve thousand dollar strasser is found in this this action is made in austria and what we have going on here is if i take this out you do the, the bolt release is where a normal 700 handle would come out so this pops right out and as you can see you can see no locking lugs on this right now but what happens is is if i pop the there's a little button under here, and if I push this, the handle slides forward, firing pin drops, and the locking lugs engage. So there are four locking lugs around this bolt. And uh, these have been tested in Europe. So there's four of them, and each of them is rated individually at 82,000 PSI. So they actually only installed one of these, and then tested it at 82,000 and it, 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 it exceeds that. So it didn't fail, it actually exceeded that pressure standard. So that is way more than you're gonna get out of a 308 or a 65 Creedmoor. And I mean, this is important because any bold action that could potentially fail, like a Remington 700, for example, if it failed, that bolt is coming straight back into your cheekbone, into your face. It's really a devastating thing. I mean, this is a giant heavy metal bolt, and if it fails and comes back, it's pretty catastrophic for your face. So the pressure, the safety, those are absolutely things that should be considered. Now, what is the advantages besides just this super strong locking action? Um, well, it's that you can run this bolt insanely fast. So let me put this back together and show you what I'm talking about. So I have not shot this rifle yet. I've never shot it before. I mounted this one to 10 Trijicon on it a few minutes ago. And this, is, but this is with zero practice, never having shot the gun. This is what it looks like. We have a clear gun here. This is what it looks like to actually work this action. 
it is butter smooth I mean one finger one thumb as you can see it is insanely fast uh, really cool so we're gonna go see with zero practice how fast I can run this uh, this action couple other things I want to tell you the MSRP on the complete gun with the carbon fiber stock ready to go uh, the thread adapter all this stuff we talked about minus the scope is $3,600 is full MSRP there are also barreled actions available so if you're like I don't like that stock I want to put this in a chassis or I want a folder you can just buy the action and a barrel or you can also just buy an action and put whatever barrel you want on it. So if you wanted to go put some fancy proof carbon fiber barrel on this, easy, done deal. It's a Remington 700 action that you're putting it up to. One other feature that we have back here is when this is cocked, there's actually a little cocked indicator that pops out, says fire on it. And then, of course, the safety here is based on a Remington 700 trigger. So it sits here on the side like you're used to on Remington 700s. The mag release is non-obtrusive, out of the way, nothing sticks out, but when you want to reach it, it's just a matter of push it and it falls out in your hand. So the other feature that you guys are going to find really cool is that this not only works for right-handed shooters, right, but this can be ordered in a left-handed configuration and it's not just a left-handed bolt, it's left-hand eject. So as you can see here, there is an ejection port on this side and you can get the bolt on the left side of the gun. Now, if you already bought one in right hand, you can simply order a new left-hand eject bolt face and a left-handed bolt handle and that's all you need to switch it over if you didn't order it that way to begin with. So the overall weight of the gun with this carbon fiber stock on it, uh, with a with a full butt pad everything on it just like this without obviously without a scope just the rifle is seven and a half pounds so for a medium you know contour uh, steel barrel that's actually really pretty good so those are the features uh, the barrel actions come with a trigger this plain action alone does not come with a trigger so that's kind of the story there you can go to Strasser's USA website for more information Let's go see how fast we can shoot this. We're out here right now to see how fast we can shoot 10 rounds through the RS700 Strasser rifle. I've got a shot timer. It's going to give me a beep, and then it's going to count the shots. So, uh, yeah, let's just see what we can do. This is my first, this is the first shot I've ever taken through the rifle, so I haven't practiced. This is what, uh, I would say, a uh, medium to advanced shooter is going to be able to expect to do with this rifle. All right, 10 shots in 8.56 seconds. Okay. You guys saw it, stuck this MDT 10 round mag in, the uh, RS 700 Strasser, and without practicing, first day I've ever shot this gun, uh, we put 10 rounds through it in 8.56 seconds on a shot timer. Uh, they all went into a USPSA IPSC target. I'm not going to brag about the group because I was just smashing the trigger. But the point is, is that with some practice, you could get smoother, you could get faster. Um, if you watch the video, you'll see that I certainly, I had one that at least that I remember. It was a lot going on, but I had one where I like closed it and then didn't pull the trigger and opened it part way and went back. So I think with some practice, some dry fire, more shooting, that you get where you could just be like really smooth and not really thinking about it because I was thinking about it way too much it's not something I'm not used to not having to come up and over yet so uh, potential though is really fast like I bet with practice you could get closer to like 10 rounds in six seconds maybe and still hit a target so potentials there I'm pretty impressed I mean guys this thing is like look at look at that I mean it's so smooth <laughs> it's crazy and loading rounds doesn't the feeding is flawless i mean this is a brand new mag it's my personal mag first time i've ever used it no issues with the feeding at all so pretty impressive uh pretty impressive action bolt features pretty cool 
So let us know what you think in the comments. This is just the first video. We're going to actually do some accuracy tests and shoot some groups with different ammo and probably take it out and shoot some long range stuff with it as well and just stick a bipod on it. See what we think with more of a precision scope, uh, put a higher power scope on it. So watch for that video. Make sure you like, subscribe, and share so you don't miss any of our content. Appreciate you watching and we'll see you next time.